Austin Gomez, perhaps the most prolific upper body thrower in college wrestling today, recently made waves in the American wrestling community by defeating three-time NCAA champ and senior world finalist Yanni Diakamahalas 9-3. This was only Yanni's second loss in his college career, and per Fanco Wrestling, it snapped Yanni's 75-match college win streak. In this video, I want to analyze Gomez's four-point body lock throw. Let's check it out at full speed, half speed, then dive into the details. First, the entry. We can see that when Gomez cinches the side body lock here, Yanni threatens a leg scoop counter. And when Gomez moves the leg away, it gives Yanni the ability to bite down on the overhook and force Gomez down to his left shoulder and causes him to release the lock. Yanni appeared to be looking for a Metzger style body lock counter, which his old teammate and training partner Kyle Dake was memorably hit with in the most recent Olympics. Gomez's next move is to grab a headlock grip and threaten a cow catcher turn. As Yanni defends, Gomez transitions back to the side body lock and immediately builds up to both feet. Take a look at how Kyle Dake similarly used the threat of the cow catcher at the most recent world championships to help cinch up a body lock. The idea here is that the opponent is forced to respect the threat of the cow catcher by attempting to posture up, and in doing so, makes himself more vulnerable to a body lock. Yanni again looks for the leg scoop, but he's too late. Yanni also defends by grapevining Gomez's inside leg. To finish the throw, Gomez extends his hips, pivots to his right, swings out his inside leg to detach the grapevine, and performs a hip heist in midair to land on top. Once on the ground, Yanni immediately attempts to bridge and belly out. But because Gomez still has the body lock cinched, Gomez is able to keep Yanni's back exposed and get a two point near fall. I'm going to bring up Kyle Dake a third time to say that Gomez's inside leg swing and midair hip heist on this throw was reminiscent of Kyle Dake's throw at last year's Olympic team trials. Summing up the details, Gomez uses the threat of a cow catcher to cinch the side body lock, quickly builds to his feet, lifts and rotates the opponent while performing a mid-air hip heist, then maintains the body lock control to get two additional points. Again, without any commentary. 